So Nike has unveiled their new plus size mannequins in their flagship stores in Oxford Street, London. And they're also going to include some para athlete um, clothes as well. Some para athlete stuff. Excellent news. When I saw this today, I had to make a video about it. I was so happy because they should have been done this ages ago. It took them long. Like these big corporations, they're meant to like be big with big brains behind them. But sometimes I don't... It's a bit debatable because it's taking them all this time to realise, rah, they need some inclusivity and there's like all sorts of people in society, fat, skinny people, medium people. But like the, like, like the saying goes, better late than never. They got there in the end. I'm happy for all my fat people. <laughs> bravo, bravo. But you still got to lose weight. That's facts. Like, so use the gym stuff and be creative with it. Do you know what I'm saying? So yeah, that, um, what I wanted to talk about, um, they've got uh, there's a brand representative, um, one of their one of their one of the Nike brand representative, a woman by the name of um, Chloe, what's her name? Chloe Elliott. She's a blogger, a plus size blogger, and she left this post today, and underneath it, she left a caption that reads, um, "If anyone tries to tell you that your body size will hold you back, they are wrong." Um, when I read this, I was like, mm, Chloe, maybe you're wrong. You know why? You're wrong. For example, you couldn't be a jockey. You know, the, the horse, you couldn't be a jockey because you probably crush the horse. If not try to eat it, I'm joking. Jokes, that was jokes. I was just joking. Yeah, you probably couldn't be a jockey. You couldn't be a F1 driver. You couldn't be a 100 meter sprinter. There's so many things you couldn't be if you're that size. So if you're saying, oh, if someone tells you you can't do this and they're wrong, no, you're selling false hopes. You're wrong. Wake up, smell the coffee, get to the gym immediately. No, but for real though. So like, don't get me wrong. I'm not throwing shade. I don't got nothing wrong with fat people. I love fat people. Like I hug fat people. They're snuggly. Mm, I love them. Yeah. But I got like, don't try to like promote false stuff in it. Do you know what I'm saying? It's, I'm all happy with you being comfortable with your body. We all need to be happy with what God gives us. But some of us, it's not just what God gives us. We've also given ourselves some as well. Do you know what I'm saying? So take that away and just, you know I'm saying, that's all you got to do. Hit the gym, use what nice Nike's giving you. But I like what I like what she stands for. She's doing the yoga pose and all that. Excellent. Love it. Do you, girl? <laughs> do you? Yeah. And she also said in a post as well, a few weeks ago, someone left me a comment saying, you're mad if you think you can do ballet. And it feels, and she's saying it feels good proving people wrong, basically. Like, do you know what? It's surprising that she does ballet. That means she's mad, flexible, mad, whatever else you need to do ballet. Do you know what I mean? Because very good, but it still does not change the fact you need to go to the gym or just go for a walk. Do something. Do you know what I'm saying? Less on a on a on a on a potato bakes. You know what I'm saying? Stop going Greg's, all that stuff. I'm not even listen, real talk, yeah. Forget about forget about her, yeah. I'm happy for what Nike has done. I'm happy for all my fat people all around the world. Yo, I, listen. Yeah. Do you know what? I just want to make the world a better place. That's all I want to do. I'm just I'm a nice guy. So, you know. Peace to the world. Let's all bring the world love. I love everybody. I love you all, man. Real talk, man. Fred, I'm out.